So I am going to try out these new paints I have. And we are going to try it out on canvas today. I want to see how they work. So I'm going to use the white paint on just a little canvas bag. And we're going to see how they work today. And these are acrylic paints. You get 12 colors in a very nice box that you can keep them in. And lots of good colors you can use. Um, it does say that you can use it on paper, canvas, um, wood, all kinds of things. So it does say that it's got a creamy texture, genuine pigments, and it's artist quality. I also think it would be a great starter set too. I, I don't paint a lot. I just paint for fun, mostly to decorate things. So we're going to get started. I'm just going to put a little bit on this plate and use a regular brush, nothing fancy. And I'm just going to see how it works on the canvas. So if you wanted to make it all perfect, you could cut out some cutouts or use a template, but I am just was thinking about freehanding it, but I think I'm going to trace this heart on here just with a regular, I'm going to use a white pencil so that it blends with the paint. I put a little paint on there. As you can see, it's very thick and creamy and nice. Very good quality paint. So you can see now that I traced my little heart that I cut out and I just used a white pencil for that onto my little canvas bag that I'm now going to use the white acrylic paint on to see how it does. I'm not too worried if I'm in the lines perfect. I just want it, just basically want to try it out to see how it does on the canvas. Um, so I'm going to get started and I just have a regular soft brush you can see this is very nice very nice paint it goes on very good it'll look really good I'm trying to do this left-handed because I'm holding the camera so so my paint is going a lot further than I thought it would this is a very thick and nice paint you had seen how much I put on there and I still have some and I've been putting it on very heavy and it is coming out very very nice so I need to continue working this in a little bit um, like I said before I'm not worried too much about it being perfect because I'm probably gonna add some rhinestones and other stuff to go with it you could also very easily um, maybe put another color with it just for fun to blend in the edges or something like I said I'm not a major painter I'm a I'm definitely a crafter just to give you an idea I do a ton of crafts and I have a ton of paint in different ones um, that's just to give you an idea that I am a major crafter so um, I really like this paint and I'm very pleased with it and I can't wait to do some more projects with it so I'm gonna call it good on here for now those are my two little hearts and like I said I'm not worried about them being perfect on this project because I'm just trying it out I still have paint out of that little bit quite a bit left so I ended up wasting a little bit but I would say definitely go easy when you squeeze it out because it, it's a lot better than other ones I've tried so you use a lot less um, so it's a very, very good value and very nice, nice paints. I love the case it comes in so you can keep them nice after you're done. Just put it back in and you have your whole set. And I barely used any of that white paint. Could have even used less to make my canvas. And just to show you it, it does very nice on paper. It's going on very smooth. I don't really paint a lot on paper um, or anything like that, but I do on this. 
and I think this material turned out good. And if you like to use like artist canvas and other things, I'm sure it would work amazing because it's a great paint.